What is up guys, today is my 100th video and to celebrate I'm going to be doing a desk setup tour and then announcing my giveaway competition so stick around for that but first let's start with my desk setup tour. So this is the general overview of my desk setup. So I have my office chair, I have my MacBook Pro set up there, I have my keyboard for music production and up to my Apple boxes up there but we'll go into things into a bit more detail. First is the office chair, I got off a mate for a tenor, so it was absolutely bargain, it was just giving me a way to clear some space, so I lashed onto that, so I'm really, really happy I did it, it's so comfortable. Next, come on to the absolute beast and centre of my whole entire setup, and that is my 13-inch MacBook Pro Baseline 2012 model. And I've upgraded this, I did the 8GB RAM upgrade a few months ago, which there's a video on that. Then if you check out yesterday's video and the rest of the series coming this week, you'll see I've done a 120GB SSD installation upgrade to this bad boy. Uh, so I took the optical drive out, uh, put the hard drive where the optical drive was, put the SSD where the hard drive was, and so now I have SSD and my 500GB hard drive in absolute beast setup. And uh, yeah, this is an absolute Trojan. I use this for my video editing, my music production, uh, graphics editing, uh, just general work. I've been using this so much for all my engineering at university in September next year. And uh, yeah, it's an absolute Trojan. I literally use this like a you know top line iMac. And yeah, it does struggle on a couple of tasks, but it gets them all done. And uh, it's an absolute beast. And this is the awesome thing about you know Apple products. You know this the fans going on the whole time is you know getting super hot because it's working so hard. But yeah, I know because of the build quality, it is going to last. And uh, yes, yeah, so that's the absolute beast. So basically, this is linked up to my external display. And this is an old Dell display. It's a nine uh, twenty inch display. So that's linked by having a Thunderbolt to DVI cable. That's this thing here, and then DVI going into my actual monitor. Uh, then the uh, this cable is going around the back to my mixer here. So my mixer, that's where I have my output, and uh, also where I can input for my microphone when I do my commentaries, and uh, if I want to record anything for my music production. Uh, then I have my Audio Technica ATH M50s. These are awesome, awesome headphones. I did a review on these, it's got thousands of views, so it's been super cool, one of my uh, best rated reviews I've ever done, so really, really happy with that. And uh, yeah, these are absolutely amazing headphones, what I do for music production. Then with that, I also have these uh, speakers you see there. Yes, they're not the best at all. I got these for about 20 quid about four years ago. But, you know, they're just, if I want to listen to stuff, you know, my head's hurting from wearing headphones all day. I just want to listen to, you know, watching a movie or whatever. I'm happy with that. And uh, the subwoofer is then down there. Uh, it's see, very dusty. And uh, so also, this is kind of where my wires go. That's my attempt at uh, good cable management. I know it's not the best at all, but it's doing for me. And I be there's no point in really doing it properly because I will be going to uni in a couple of months. Um, but then, yeah, the other great thing about this monitor is that it is a USB hub as well. That's got four USB outputs on there. So I have this uh, pink coloured USB. That's an optical cable which plugs into the back. And if you see the back, I have all my wires going in there and out. And uh, then I also have my MacBook Pro attached to my external hard drive that's a one terabyte uh, hard drive which I have partitioned so I have one half for a Mac content so I just load any external files like I have all my YouTube videos saved onto there and uh, then the other half is my backup drive which backs up now both the SSD and the uh, hard drive so that's just a really awesome setup and that is then backed up to our main uh, wireless hard drive in my dad's study downstairs so everything's all awesomely backed up so that's basically the main desk setup then i'm up to my boxes have the uh, ipad third generation rest display box the iphone 5 and my macbook pro box and the magic mouse uh, i like to say that i earned all these things i didn't get given them i admit i got a little bit of help from macbook pro but the iphone 5 paid for that i'm paying for all my bills i've paid for half the ipad because i share it with my dad and uh, yeah so just so you know, I actually do pay for all of this stuff with my own money. Uh, same with everything you see here. 
This is my keyboard, which I use with my Logic Pro for all my music production. That's using Logic Pro 9. So next up, I have my Apple Magic Mouse. I was given this last year. And I absolutely love it. I know a lot of people hate it and they prefer things like the Logic Performance MX. Uh, but I personally love it. It's great for sliding uh, around my timeline in both uh, Final Cut Pro and Logic, which, which I use. I've well and truly got used to it. I've uh, added my own multitask gestures for getting around OS X and I uh, absolutely love it. Then next to it, I have my Apple iPhone 5. Absolutely love this thing. As you can see, it's running iOS 7. If you haven't checked out all my iOS 7 videos, make sure you do. Uh, there's a playlist for it. And uh, yeah, I absolutely love iOS 7. Love my iPhone 5. Uh, very, very, very content with it. And yeah, it works for me, and that's what makes me happy. And that is it, guys. That is my tour of my setup. I absolutely love it, you know, for what it is, for the things that I have I think I've done a pretty good job with what I've got and uh, I'm very happy with it but now let's move on to the giveaway so now it's the part of the giveaway now there's going to be an international giveaway so you live anywhere in this earth then you are eligible to win this device and what you're going to win is a Yi super portable battery USB charger. I've reviewed this, it has very, very good battery life, 2000 mAh hour batteries, it's very light, you can just carry it anywhere, charge up your smartphone, mobile device, whatever it is. So it is a pretty sweet giveaway. Now, if you want to win this giveaway, there are three things you need to do. Number one is to subscribe to Apple iPhone Tech UK, my channel. Secondly is to click the click to tweet link down below or then tweet out the uh, competition to all of your followers on Twitter. And the third thing is to leave a comment down below with anything relevant to this video, whether it's about my setup or your setup and also with your Twitter handle. If you do all those three things, you'll be eligible to win this device. In about a week, I'll go through all the comments, pick one out with random.org and then choose the the winner and I'll post the winner at the end of any of my videos next week in the title of the video it won't be giveaway winner or anything like that therefore you have to watch all my videos next week if you want to be notified if you are the indeed the winner of this video I know it sounds like a lot of effort but think about it I know a very big channel and so you, your chance of winning are a hell of a lot bigger than trying to win a competition like soldier knows best with 500,000 subscribers so I think it's definitely worth trying out for this giveaway so anyway guys good luck hope you enjoyed my death setup tour video and giveaway make sure you do subscribe follow me on twitter and i'll see you guys in the next one